Welcome to my YouTube channel. This is Michael Nostro at Foster Creations. Today, I wanted to look at the chart for Sam Altman, who was recently fired and rehired from uh, the company called uh, Open AI. If you look to the Eastern Horizon using Vedic Sidereal Zodiac, you would see the constellation of Gemini rising around six, zero degrees. Uh, first, we'll look and see how the planets are operating, and then we'll see when they're operating during certain events in his life and what could be done to strengthen the chart. So he has a very strong, exalted sun, which is ruling the third house of entrepreneurial success uh, through uh, IT, and it's placed in his income house. And this gives him really strong leadership abilities. He is the CEO of Open uh, AI. If you, and then uh, we have a weak placement and an infant state, exalted moon, uh, ruling the house of wealth, and it's placed in the twelfth of uh, the twelfth house, which uh, can be challenging, makes him feel like an outsider at times. Um, and then we have weak placement Mars, uh, ruling the house of income, uh, placed in also placed uh, in with the moon in the twelfth house, uh, also giving him the ability to think out of the out of the box and giving him uh, income through uh, IT engineering skills. We have a, a weak debilitated Mercury. Um, ruling the house of happiness and it, it's so there can be some some depression uh, and some challenges in relationships and also uh, can give him controversial speech you know he's he's warned about the dangers of AI um, weak placement, debilitated Jupiter. Jupiter's ruling the house of partnerships. He has ha had struggles in his partnerships. Then we have very, very strong Venus. Venus is probably his uh, next to Sun, one of his uh, strongest planets. Uh, gives uh, rules the house of investments. Gives investments uh, through IT. Um, Venus is in the. Uh, career house uh, aspected by Mercury, giving that IT abilities. Then we have weak infant state Saturn. Um, Saturn's ruling the house of good fortune and it's placed in the sixth house of conflicts and uh, health issues. Um, but he's, he has a strong interest in health care. And so uh, this is... Uh, and, and it gives him the ability to work very hard and be focused. Uh, in every chart, uh, Rahu and K2 are challenging. Uh, they're balancing spiritual and material things. Uh, gives him a desire to, Rahu's in the, in the house of income, gives desire for income. And K2 in the fifth house gives insights into investing. So let's look at the timing of events. Uh, he dropped out of uh, Stanford um, in 05 and started Looped, which was a social media company. Um, this is during a Rahu period. So Rahu can have a downside to it, um, you know, creating um, life-changing events. Loop didn't do too well. And, uh, and then in 2012, he um, broke up from a long nine-year relationship uh, during a Mercury period, Mercury is ruling the house of happiness in his relationships. Then we have, um, he became president of Y Combinator in 2014, also during a Mercury period. Mercury is sitting in his career house. Um, and then in 2015, he became CEO of Open AI, which did chat GBT. Um, and that's also during a Mercury period. Mercury, um, again, influencing IT on his career. 
Uh, he started United Slate Healthcare in 2018 during a Venus period, Venus having to do with life-saving drugs. Uh, in 2019, he uh, started World Coin uh, during a sun period, sun giving these uh, entrepreneurial skills again, um, got fired uh, from OpenAI in uh, November 17th of 2023. And at that time, Rahu, if you look at the chart on the left, Rahu and K2 are close to the rising sign degree. So they're creating some stress in six out of his 12 houses. And then he got rehired a few days later. Um, now, when, when he got fired, Moon was pretty weak. Uh, Moon, an indicator for career in this particular Gemini chart. And then uh, Moon was much stronger and in his career house when he got hired back on the 22nd. Uh, what could be done to strengthen the chart? Well, he's already doing lots of charity work for Rahu, transforming Rahu and K2. And then the rest of the planets could be strengthened with my favorite remedy, uh, uh, Kavash. And if you uh, uh, if you wanted to get a Kavash or learn Vedic astrology or get a reading, you can go to www.vastucreations.com. Thank you so much for listening.